Dear colleagues, I have the pleasure to invite you to an excursion to the beach forests of Europe. Let's change from the wet to wood, from blue of modern sea to the green of uh, beach forests. Uh, the beech, Fagus sylvatica, is a very common tree in uh, Europe, but and wide distributed, as you see. But beech forests are really fascinating ecosystem. I have three topics. I start with a story. I explain the OUV and uh, come um, finally to an outlook. The uh, story began nearly 200 years ago with the first distribution map of a plant species, and that is number one, Fagus, uh, in the first atlas for plant geography all over the world. Uh, nearly 100 years later, beech forest came in the focus <coughs> of geobotanical research, but for nature conservation, it was not an issue in that time. Beach forests were uh, ignored for a long time. Twenty years uh, before, we looked in an European uh, working session of uh, IUCN and WCPA for potential natural heritage sites in uh, Europe. And uh, with this uh, map of natural vegetation of Europe, the uh, natural value of beech forests in Europe were discovered. In a conference in Ukraine, the question of uh, world heritage for beech forests were discussed first a uh, time about the virgin forest of the Carpathians. Two years later, we started in Germany a process also to look for the value of ancient uh, beech forests. And uh, 2007, the primary beech forests of the Carpathians were inscribed as the World Natural Heritage uh, Site, as last remnants of virgin forests in Central Europe. 2010, we submitted as Germany the extension nomination uh, to the World Heritage Center with the agreement of Ukraine and Slovak Republic. And 2011, the ancient beech forests were inscribed as extension to the existing site. And now it is a serial transnational World Natural Heritage Site consisting of uh, 15 component parts in three countries. It was uh, hard work for several years at local level, at national level, and uh, at international level. We uh, organized a series of uh, workshops, and uh, this is the uh, current result, the trilateral World Heritage Site. But, but what is the outstanding universal value of a forest with a very common tree? Uh, the uh, inscription was on the base of criteria 9, outstanding examples representing significant ongoing ecological and biological processes and so on. You know this uh, criterion. And uh, the remaining European ancient beech forests are, and that's accepted, an outstanding and globally unparalleled example of the ongoing ecological, uh, ecological processes that are for at first that one single tree species has come to the absolute domination in natural vegetation in large parts of a continent. And the forests are adapted to very diverse site conditions within the large distribution area which boundaries are primarily defined by climate. And you could see from the seashore and uh, lowlands up to the uh, border uh, uh, forest line in the mountains, beach forest dominate. From seashore here from the Baltic uh, sea coast in Germany through the uh, northern central European lowlands to the uh, 
no uh, mountains, uh, sub-mountain regions in Central Europe to uh, mountain areas and finally to the upper uh, forest line in uh, mountains of Central and uh, Southern Europe. <laughs> they uh, cover a broad spectrum of different site uh, conditions from poor sand to chalk, from uh, moist to uh, dry conditions, from acid to uh, basic. In uh, here, only two examples, sand dunes uh, at the seashore with beach forest, or here limestone rocks in the Alps, also covered by beach forest. They have a very diverse uh, uh, classification with a lot of different types, uh, types characterized by different plant geographical uh, groups. Here only the part on eutrophic uh, sites with uh, nearly 60 different uh, types all over Europe. The second uh, point is uh, the uh, complete replacement of a climate ecosystem by a new one as a consequence of post-glacial uh, uh, post climate change. What it uh, means. Uh, the beach um, survived uh, while the uh, Pleistocene area in refuge uh, areas in southern Europe and distributed from that uh, refuge areas about large parts. But before the expansion of Fagos, large parts of Europe were covered already by primarily a uh, primary uh, lime mixed forest, the uh, dark green in this uh, map. In brown, the uh, area of beach 6,000 years before. Today, the situation is completely changed. Lime mixed forest, we have only in continental parts of temperate zone in Europe, and the western and central parts are would be covered by natural beach forest in different altitudinal beds. It is a wide range. We um, divided this range in 12 uh, beach forest regions characterized by site conditions and plant geographical uh, character. And I would demonstrate you a few examples from all these regions from southwest in the Pyrenaic Iberian region with the southwesternmost uh, sites, then the oldest stocks in Apennine Mountains in Italy and the central Mediterranean region. The Illyric region as a uh, refuge area and the main uh, area for extension in post-glacial times. The Mersian Balkanic region in the uh, southern Balkanic Peninsula, including uh, the southeasternmost stocks in uh, Greece here on, uh, at Olympus Mountains. A huge area would be covered in Central Europe in the sub-Atlantic uh, Herzönic region with uh, the German component parts from uh, Heinich and Kellerwald. The Alpic region with very few remnants of uh, primary forests. The Carpathian with the largest stocks today. And uh, finally, the uh, Atlantic region where only few and small remaining stocks occur. And in the northern border, the uh, beach forest at the Baltic Sea shore here on uh, Rügen. The third uh, point is the cyclic regeneration and the survival as a climax ecosystem with structures of real virgin forests typical uh, for wilderness within intensive cultural landscapes with a long history of uh, land use. That means, it is a little bit uh, sophisticated this <laughs> sentence, but it means uh, this parts of Europe would be covered under natural, covered by forests under natural conditions, but with the extension of agriculture in the Neolithic period, the uh, forests were reduced, 
cut it, and the forest wilderness, the primeval forest wilderness of Europe, were changed to cultural landscapes as we know today. But very few and small areas survived or regenerated to natural like forest structures and the green uh, patches on the map that are remaining deciduous forest uh, stocks, not only uh, beach forest, but in the beach forest distribution area. It's hard to and that is uh, what, uh, what we mean, the survival of patches within extensive cultural <coughs> landscapes. <coughs> so, the primeval beach forests of the Carpathians and the ancient beach forests of Germany are the best <coughs> old growth forest stocks at the end of beach, uh, beach forest distribution in Europe. And here, in few pictures, the regeneration cycle about three, four hundred uh, years from juvenile to uh, um, old uh, stands, the decay uh, phase, and the uh, uh, wood cycle. And finally, beach forests are also an example, a unique example of ongoing and permanent accumulation and fixation and storage of carbon in the living biomass, in the dead biomass, and in the humus of uh, soil. My last point, the outlook, the decision <coughs> of the World Heritage Committee was uh, together with a recommendation also by IUCN to continue the process and to look for other important stocks of beach forests in Europe for a complete and finite serial transnational nomination of significant primeval and ancient beach forests all over Europe, and we started this process with several uh, workshops at expert level in uh, several countries of Europe. The next meeting will be tomorrow in Vienna. Um, we, with a research project of the Federal Agency for Nature Conservation, we identified nearly 100 ancient beach forests all over Europe and selected 45 areas as candidates uh, for an extension nomination on the base of special <coughs> criteria. For every uh, new component part, uh, we have to justify the additional value and we uh, uh, defined few of such uh, additional values the process was continued as ministerial level with uh, invitations to the uh, other countries to discuss the other <laughs> process. And uh, finally, with the uh, applications to the tentative list, uh, 11 countries with 30 areas are in the further process of uh, nomination. Here the uh, countries and areas are listed on the map. Beach forests are European phenomenon. They are part also of European identity. Then uh, never where on the world such forests exist. And European countries have the responsibility to save this natural her heritage of global importance. The aim of the process